Hello and welcome to another video from Paraplays and today I'm going to be playing Call to Arms. Now if you've played Men of War, is it Assault 2? Men of Assault War 2, one of those, I've forgotten the name of it now. Then this is going to be very familiar to you. This is basically a standalone version that's available on the Steam Workshop for $18.99 but if you go to places like Kingwin or CD Keys, is it, you can get the Deluxe Edition for less than £10. So I do like my strategy games and this is a game that I used to play a lot of but found it very very difficult in multiplayer and the more you get your ass whooped the less you want to come back and play it. But now that it's a modern combat scenario so you've got the Marines, the Rangers, Humvees, Strikers, A-10 Warthogs, all sorts in here. It's really piqued my interest again and it's a game I think you can get your teeth into. As you've seen on the channel, I've started to play a little bit of war game as well with some of the lads. So in this video, I'm literally just going to do the first mission. It is beta, it's not early access, but it's still kind of beta-ish. I'm going to do the first mission, which is kind of probably a tutorial mission. And we'll try and do it as tactically as we can. Try and be sneaky and a little bit clever. So let's jump into Call to Arms. I quite like it. Let's see what you think. If you thumbs up and you want to see some more, let me know. Otherwise, I shall just play it on my own. Anyway, let's get onto the battlefield and have a look at Call to Arms. Hunt! So here we are, and I'm probably going to go for normal. I probably could do easy. Depends if I get my ass whooped, then I'll re-record this and I'll redo it again. But let's just go for normal, and we'll go for ambush, which is the first level here. And so many different variants of the Marines and things like that. There's snipers, heavy sniper. Uh, there are lots of vehicles in here, and as, as I mentioned, this is a learning process for me. So it looks like oh, the first one is Ambush, US Marines Recon Squad on Routine Patrol. Oh, so we've got the Humvees, the Marines getting out. Happy G, happy G! Good by the voices at the bottom. We've got wounded! We need evac now! Wow, audio quite loud and beefy in my headset actually. We don't have much time, our men are still in a fight. One click north. Ready up your gear and let's move out. So here we are. So this is here we are in the game, and as you can see, it looks really quite nice. Get your men to cover, it won't be long until they pinpoint our position. So you can see this looks really quite nice. And uh, as we zoom in, we can see these are actually the Marines. You can see an, uh, is that an M4? Another M4, looks like a, is that a saw? Uh, I think that's an M M249. Uh, is that an ACOG, red dot? Right, so let's get our guys into cover. So I'm going to put two. Yes, sir! Actually, yeah, yeah, fuck it. And as we come up to here, we'll get those over there, and we'll get Got two it, on this side. And we'll go into the intricacies of um, a lot of these other buttons and the menu system and everything else as we go along. So, looks like the enemy hostile. Military. There we go. Turn that around. These guys, any commands? It's the enemy are only really coming. Next one. Nice and easy. That's it. Move on. We are losing time. So what I think I'll do is for now, what we can do is if we select it, these sir. two. And I just click here. They will move in a ready to fire position with weapons up, as you can see. If I select these guys, yes, and sir. Double click them. They will run, but they won't fire. They will ignore all enemies before they actually get there. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pause it here now, and I'm just going to check the levels because it seems really, really loud. Okay, so let's move these guys up. Got it, sir. And I'm going to get them to sprint 
directly over here, I think. Let's get them over there. There we go. There go our marines. And of course the difference is with other games is that you can select these individually. You don't have to select them as a unit. So for example, yes, uh, this guy here, as you can see down at the bottom right, he's got an M4A1, close quarters. You could put him, you could put, select him individually, he says. Hang on. Aim is in the reach, so let's give him Just fire. put him over here. So you have got quite a lot of tactical options when it comes to actually placing your men. So for now I'm just going to keep these Go, guys sir. together and just get them to move up here. But let's rush up. So we've got a technical incoming. The load of jihadis. guys up to this side and up here looks like that vehicle's actually moving to the strip that's a good position fire at that take it out take it out take it out and get back I didn't actually want you all to run out there but that's because I selected them all as an entire squad okay it looks like the rest of the Marines are moving up so we're gonna move up as well Let's get moving, guys. Lock and load. Radio check. Over. Heal loud and clear. We will send him many back. We need to clear this hot zone before any vehicles can move in. Hurry up and proceed with the evacuation plan. Okay. Uh, right, guys, move up here. Obviously, this is quite easy because it's like basically a, like a tutorial. It's like we've got quite a way to go, so I'm going to rush these guys up. And we, so we have actually got an enemy in this building here. So what I might do is let's come up to this side. To move, 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 move. Shit, shit, shit. Get in the cover quick, 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 quick. Right. I want this guy, this Marine here. I want you to throw a grenade here. And get back. Okay, so now we've got enemies on this side. M4A1, I want you to move on that corner. Quickly. I want you here. Actually, yeah, I'm going to move them all. I actually just selected them all by accident then. Not quite how I wanted that to go down, but okay. Yes, sir. Move here. So that the rest of the marines are moving up. Right guys, quickly, move. Get behind that cover. Now we know we've got an enemy behind this technical here. Uh, we've got anybody with a bazooka. Yes. Blow that vehicle up. Quite sure why you won't yes, blow that up. Yes, Do as you're told. I want you to blow that up. Yes, Must be a civilian vehicle. Must be rules of engagement. So you won't actually fire yes, against that. Right, guys. I want you to move up to. Let's have a look. So we know there's enemies here. Move to this position. Move, move, move. Go, go, go. It's fucking loud, guys. Right. M401. A1. I want you here. Are you on the roof. You move up there. Now again, we've got to be careful up there, you can see this guy here, because I didn't select individually, he went the quickest route to actually get to that location, which is not really what I wanted him to do. So now we've got a marine up on the roof here, of these three, there's the Humvee, I'm actually going to select this guy again. You move in there. Uh, guy with the scar. 
want you to clear out this building. Guy on the roof. Reposition. Okay, now that's clear. Right, I want all four of you stacked there. Shit, got an enemy there. He's down, he's down. Okay, so they're in good cover now. You can see, moving to clear the other side of the road from hostiles. Okay, we're gonna move as a four. I want you to smoke the road before we cross. Smoke that road. Shit, it's a technical coming in. As soon as that road is smoked, we are gonna move. Got it, sir. Right, move, move, move. Okay, well, moving up now. Right. Grenade. Grenade that position. Nice, that took him out. Move up. Okay, I want you two. Yes, sir. Here. On my way. It's a striker moving up. It's quite good, is this game. I'm really quite enjoying it, to be honest. So they're getting in the striker. A little bit of a strange animation at the back there, but it looks like they are actually getting in, which is quite cool. Um, right, my team. It's very suspicious. Guys. Get in the Humvee. Got it, sir. Move, move, move. Go, go, go. Double time, double time. There we go. That's our Marines back in the Humvee. So now we're going to crew the Mark 19, which is a grenade launcher. Uh, we sent you coordinates for extract. Intel reports hostile movement. Don't let that stop you and bring back our wounded safely. So we've got a technical on the bridge got to escort the medivac now what we can do here is, is if we zoom right in we can actually take control of this now and I can actually drive the V as well this is all available in excuse me multiplayer as well so we're just going to stop that here because we're, we're going to support these guys we're not actually going to move in at this stage slowly slowly there's technical on the bridge there we're going to get one out for a range a little bit higher now you can see the, the dot is red, it means it's just out of effective range, so we're going to move up slightly. Just get some out. We're moving a little bit closer. Leave the Humvee here. Now we should be able to set that out quite easily. There's green. It's a good effective range. And that's one down. There's another one over here. Hand on the bridge. There's one actually further out there as well. I'm gonna push across the bridge. Of course, we need to watch our six as well. Watch out for suicide bombers. Another one to the left. Right, we're reloading. So I'm gonna pull back slightly. Getting catch the shot from behind as well. Come on, reload, reload. Don't want this guy to hit me. Medivac, second hit, so we've got to move, we've got to move. Go, 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 go. Shit. They have recoilless gun on that vehicle. Take it out now. So that's the black and red technical. Oh, we gotta move, we gotta move. Push on front. 
through. Shit. Yeah, come on guys, we gotta move, we gotta move. Got some of these could be suicide bombers. Hit it! Hit it! Looks like we escorted the medivac to safety. Probably not the best there. Probably missed out on a few vehicles and we accomplished it. So that is part one of Call to Arms. So if you want to see some more, let me know. Looks like this could be quite a good game. And I think in multiplayer, especially in co-op as well, with some of your friends, by the time you've got the Blackhawks with the miniguns and the Warhawks and everything else. I think it'd be really quite good. But anyway, that's part one of Call to Arms. And if you want to see some more, thumbs up, let me know in the comments below and I'll do some more. In the meantime, I shall see you on the battlefield, soldier. Bye-bye.